it's your girl KC. Welcome back. Welcome back. And guys, we're almost at 3,000 subscribers. Yay! 3K. That is so crazy. And that might seem small to you, but get a YouTube channel and get 3K subscribers. You'll see how hard or difficult that is. So I am definitely celebrating that milestone and I want to double that guys. So I'm going to put on the road to 6K, 6K subscribers. And I've looked at my most viewed videos and they're all about hair and reviews. So today we have a special review. We have Ari Sheen or Ari Shine. I don't know if I'm pronouncing it correctly. Magnetic eyeliner and eyelashes kit. Now this kit has saved me when it comes to lashes because to be honest i don't know how to put on regular lashes i struggle i think i've successfully was able to put like one eye on and the other one i couldn't put on so then i just took them all off but this right here magnetic eyelashes ladies if you just want something that's just gonna whoop and pop right on get magnetic eyelashes now these are by arishine and i'll go ahead and open them up as you can see I have a pair on. Ooh. And so it comes with five lashes. I think I have a clip where I can show you all five of the lashes close up. comes with something for everyone because the top lash is so subtle like it's hardly like anything's on but then these bottom lashes oh honey like you might fly away with those oh you can see these from a mile away and I kind of like the dramatic look I used to be more subtle now I don't really like the ones that have like that separation you see what I mean like the ones I have on now and these ones aren't separated as much but this one right here it's like really separated and I feel like it looks kind of fake, you know? It looks kind of plasticky and fake, you know? But the other four lashes, I definitely can deal with. This one, eh, I can live without. But like I said, guys, it comes with two magnetic eyeliners here and here. And then it also comes with something that has definitely saved me. It comes with this little eyelash picker upper thingamajig in which you just kind of Get the lash off, right? And it's kind of magnetic, look, it's hanging on. It's, it's little magnets on the strip and I'm gonna show you guys up close. Oh, I'm doing it backwards, all right. Once you put the magnetic eyeliner on and you let it dry, you just put this on, plop it on and boop. And you know what guys, I'm gonna show you a demonstration right on my hand. So let's, open up an eyelash or eyeliner rather magnetic eyeliner come on up let me wipe off any oils or grease on my hand and let's and here's how it looks guys it literally looks like eyeliner and when it dries it's kind of thickens a little bit so be careful not to get these on your eyelashes because you can lose a few eyelashes or two if you put this too, too, too close on your eyelashes. So I'm gonna just put something here. And I like to use a thicker line just to make sure they're secure. All right, so we're gonna let that dry. And it's nice that it comes with two because as you know, like the more you use this, the more clumpy it gets. And to be honest, I'm supposed to shake it before each use, but I definitely forgot. But either way, it should definitely work. And honestly, this guys, it's a lifesaver. If you struggle with putting on lashes, try magnetic lashes. And let me show you the lash strip up close. Let me see if I can do that. Um, Let's see, let's find one that I have not used. So you can see it. I don't know if you guys are gonna be able to see it. Hold on, let me see. Focus, focus. All right, 
You see the magnets a little bit? Come on, focus. There's like five magnets. There's one here, 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 and here. Can you see it a little bit? Kind of, there you go. You see one. So there's like five magnets on it. And what you do is you take this little eyelash holder thingamajig and you just watch this. And she's on. Look, that wasn't hard at all. And so what I like to do is I try to just put one magnet down on one end, but, but don't put the magnet on the other side and then smooth it out like left to right. Now, when you put them on, make sure you don't put them too close to your inner eyelids because it's going to be uncomfortable. It's going to be scratching the inside of your nose and it's going to be uncomfortable and you're going to feel it every time you blink. So give it about a quarter of an inch to the left or to the right of your eye. Just leave some space in the inner eyelid. And as I'm talking, look, it's coming up. So you definitely have to <laughs> eyelash fail while doing an eyelash review video. Now, when you put on the lashes, make sure that you're not too close to your inner eyelids. Make sure they're like a quarter of an inch out because one, your eyelids, your eyes get watery. And when they're too close to the inner corner, the water will kind of mess up the eyelash glue and such. And also when you blink your eyes, it's like you'll feel it like tickling the side of your nose or it's uncomfortable every time you blink. So make sure you kind of push the lashes out just a little bit so they're not touching the inner corners of your eyelid. But, and also make sure you have a good amount of eyeliner in the inner corner because for some reason it loves to lift in the inner corner. Maybe it's because it's near like the tear duct and so it, your eyes can water or at least mine can water. So definitely put a good amount of glue in those inner corners. Okay, make sure it's nice and secure. But look at this, guys. It's sticking. And let me see if I do like a little tub test. It's not moving. Look, I'm trying to flip it up. And even when I try to, it doesn't want to, but it's coming up. Oh, I'm messing up my eye, my eyelashes just for you guys. There we go. Now you kind of see how that glue kind of um was a bit gooey when I pulled it up. So be careful you don't get these on your eyelashes, guys. When the eyeliner dries, it gets a little bit thick. So make sure you don't get them too, too close to your eyelashes. Like leave a little bit of space or even just kind of like move your eyelashes down and then put a line on them. And if you don't care about your lashes, then hey, just put the eyeliner right on. But if you care about your natural lashes, try not to get the glue too, too, too close to your lashes. But overall, guys, I really do like these lashes. To be honest, I will not be able to put on lashes without magnetic eyelashes. Now, in this little kit, they do say in case you're allergic to the eyeliner, try it out on your skin first to see how it feels before you put them on your eyes because your eyes can be very sensitive. Kind of like when you go get your eyelashes done, they kind of do a little test. Well, they should do a little test to see if you're allergic to the glue that they have. Same applies here. So definitely try it out, guys. See how you feel, maybe put it here, put it there, put it somewhere in your face and just see how it reacts. And if you're not allergic to it and you have about 20 to $25 to spare for five reusable eyelashes with two eyeliners and a little eyelash thingamajig to help you put them on, I think that's a good deal, guys, because you can definitely get like three, four, five weirs or even more depending on how you take care of lashes from just this little kit right here. So these are the Ari Shine Magnetic Eyeliner and Eyelash Kit. And if you get them guys, let me know how you like them. And also there's so many different magnetic eyelash kits out on the market, but I can't really speak for those. I can only speak for this one. And this one so far, I definitely like. So comment down below guys, let me know if you're gonna try out this eyelash kit or if there's another brand of eyelashes that I should definitely try out. They definitely have to be magnetic though because I don't know how to put on regular lashes. But anyways, guys, I hope this review was helpful. Comment down below and let me know if it was. Also, don't forget to smash that like button, hit that subscribe button, and tell a friend to tell a friend to tell a friend to subscribe to the channel on the road to 6K, and we're gonna get there before the end of the year. Well, that's it for this video, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.